Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Yeah. Hello? <laughs> you fucker. Yeah. Michael Phoenix has been in town to leave. Okay, whatever, whatever. You about to go see Lester real quick. And I'm gonna take this Audi looking like. Nah, this right here is like a Malibu. I don't want that though. I want this baby right here. Oh shit! Oh shit! Get out the car! Doc, hey! Michael, well, I'm looking through my appointment book and I don't see your name. Yeah, well, I'm more of a walk in guy, Doc. You know that. Walk-ins are more expensive, but I'm always happy to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as I got money in my pocket, right? Hey, I'm in a bad way, Doc. I might come by soon. Whoa, that was construction, baby. Get some air, though. Get some air, though. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo. Get some air though, yeah. Y'all like that? Don't hate, don't hate. Just stop all the hate. Wait, let me look at this map. Where we at? Okay, okay. Yeah, let me go across the bridge. Get out of the way, man. Nobody got all day. We gotta go to the right. Let's cut this right and see where it takes us. Commercials make the world go around as much as Power Pop hits do. Oh, oh. This dinner time sound like this. I'm not eating this crap. Get out of the way, homie. This Friday night sound like this. Get some air though. We're gonna make a right right here. We're gonna bust this left. Left it should be up here on the left. Vigilante is getting tough on illegal immigration. New movies meltdown and spy thriller. Yeah, right here. Yeah, right here. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're gonna make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean... I need something done, you need to know something, so... Why not help each other? I gotta make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone. That instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> since you put it like that... Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little college boy sack of shit phony fuck. Who? 
Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. I heard him say that he saved America. What, by, by outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white-collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag, and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is going to be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll find something. Just like the old days. Well, we gotta go to the suburban store and let's see what they want us to do, man. Wait, wait, wait. Y'all wanna see your boy spin it around though? Spin it around. That was a little something, something. Not too much, you know what I mean? I'm trying to figure out like like what this dude really plan on doing, man. Like, like what he got up his sleeves is what it sound like. He sound like he's planning something real big. He said the biggest junk about life. I'm trying to see what he trying what, what he talking about, you know what I mean? Get out of the way. Almost missed that turn just now too. Yeah, ooh, let me get that. Yeah, let me get that up also. We almost there. It's a gun shop. I gotta start going to the gun stores to get my hair cut, stuff like that. You know what I mean? I gotta start. There you go, suburban gun right here. Diet sodas are actually worse for you, you know. I am not carrying. Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Shut up, Holden. Oh. Give me something to wear. What about a Wrong vest too. and some cargo shorts? All right. Not really my thing. Let me get down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let me get down. Tragic, but they'll do. Let me go back here and get this red and get the red joint. The kicks with that. Fella. Good luck at the interview. Ladies, you matching? Goodbye. Yeah, I guess that'll work. Okay. Let's go to this interview, though. Whatever he was talking about. Meow. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Act entitled. The boy be driving, though. Yeah, I be driving. Yeah, I be whipping. 
Ryan, Ryan, and I'm getting it. Find a prototype. Hey. Hey. Oh, great. Ugh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke bricks bowed up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I, I tea temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Ah, uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. You know, a consultancy, consultancy, consultancy. I'm kind of big on the conference tour already. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. I mean, a terrible back. Yeah, I had a week back. About a week back. Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Ah, mm. uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. Your son codes? Start him early, bro. You write your best stuff in your tweens. After that, it's just a hack job. You want a massage? Cause my hands are free. <laughs> oh, he gay now? Give me a second, will ya? Rocking out might get you in the right headspace. They gotta send me on another one of those seminars. Ah, won't run with the pop-ups up. And now we scan. Pop-up still coming up. Might be why I get all these migraines. <laughs> Seriously, it, it might be why. There it goes. My glitch fixing is gonna be way down today. <laughs> and that oh. should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. <laughs> That's the prototype. Switch it, switch it, boy. Go ahead and switch it, homie. Oh, nice. Get the book bag. Making history, dude. Hey, and when we couldn't do it without the little guys. All their Bye. We'll know Why ain't you take the book bag? I wanted though. Oh shit! He kicked that hacky sack right in that dude's face. If you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Some a hole drank my effing head milk. There was a totally non-passive aggressive note on it. Wow. Hold on, it. I'll buzz you out. Thank you, Boo Boo. Watch the keynote at Michael's house. Okay. I'm gonna need this Jag, though. I'm gonna need this Jag. Hey, Michael, hold on, hold on. Don't! I don't ya! Lester, 
The thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry, the phone is rigged. Now what's your problem, you don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes, none of which interest me. Hey, I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Now, ah, whatever you say, enjoy yesterday. Yeah, anyway, just go? call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. Out. No! I'm watching Famer Shame! Tough fucking tits! No! Give it up! <laughs> the most nicest guy in America. America loves you. You are in the final. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage! Here we go. Hey. This company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Caraway. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years. That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary. Okay, dude, come on. Show me the thing now. Today, right here, we are about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24 seven. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with some kids at the public pool. Hold on a second. You. I think someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? Hello? Oh! Oh, get oh, oh Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 Let's... No, 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 no. Whoa! Oh. The West Coast leads the country in correctional facility. Locking away half the population. Oh, Shiza. Well, at least the mission pass, y'all. That's all we want. <laughs> Stay tuned. It's about to get real good.